Hello everybody and welcome to the virtual book launch for my uh, special edition of my book Born Survivors which is coming out on April 30th. It is a 75th uh, anniversary commemoration edition for the 75th anniversary of the end of the war. It marks the 75th birthdays of the three babies involved and the 75 years of course since their liberation from a concentration camp uh, in Austria called Mauthausen. And I'm extremely fortunate today to be joined by one of those miracle babies, Eva Clark, uh, 75, because everybody knows your age, Eva, because I tell everybody all the time, I'm sorry about that, but the, if it's any blessing, you don't look 75. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> um, it's an extraordinary story. Uh, I was very lucky to come across it by chance. And uh, the, the story, for those of you who don't know, it tells the true story of three young mothers who hid their pregnancies from the Nazis and gave birth in the concentration camp system. And uh, amazingly, all three mothers and all three babies survived, even though the mothers weighed under five stone at, three, at full term and all three babies weighed under, under three pounds. It's a story of incredible uh, human resilience and courage and uh, hope. Uh, the mothers were determined to, to, to survive and they thought take their beautiful babies home to their husbands. Sadly, none of them knew at that point that they'd all been murdered. Um, and Eva, it's been quite life changing for us, hasn't it? Because we have been traveling all over the world. It's been published in 22 uh, countries and translated into 16 languages. And I think we've been to something like 20 of them. <laughs> Well, certainly you have. I know I've been to several, but you yeah. have. Yeah. Yes. And we would have been um, in Mauthausen uh, next week uh, for the commemorations. We were invited by the Austrian authorities as we were um, five years ago when we first originally launched the book there. Um, and, uh, and tell us what happened when we were there last time. I mean, it was an extraordinary time, wasn't it? The, the, the president had a surprise for you. Yeah, he did indeed. Um, because it was just after our birthdays. Our birthdays are, uh, Hannah was born on the 12th of April, Mark on the 20th, and I was born on the 29th. And the commemoration in Mauthausen is always uh, the beginning of May. And anyway, we got there, they had an enormous birthday cake for us. They sang happy birthday. Um, the president of Austria had his arms around my shoulders. And we just kept thinking, well, a variety of thoughts. I kept thinking, what on earth would my mother and the other mothers be thinking? I imagine that's what they were thinking too. And I think also we're wondering, what on earth would Hitler say? Um, but we thought, you know, we won. <laughs> Absolutely. And there you were to tell the story and to live. Yeah. And, and uh, what's been so lovely for me is getting to know you all and loving you dearly. And uh, I call you siblings of the heart, and I'm so honoured that you've made me your honorary sibling. Absolutely. I mean, how could we not? <laughs> well, I mean, you have, you have done us such an enormous service by writing the story of our mothers. Um, and that having done all that incredible amount of research, retracing their steps before the war, during the war, and post-war. And that really was... Amazing. Well, I, I've written lots of books, as you know, people may know my, my work, but I honestly genuinely feel this is the most important book I will ever write. It's still the only book ever written about babies who survived the Holocaust. Uh, mm -hmm. And it's changed my life in so many ways. It's, it's humbled me. It humbles everybody we meet. We, we, we spend a lot of time talking to school children about uh, compassion and tolerance and understanding which your mother's instilled in you. And that work's been enormously uh, valuable, hasn't it? It's, uh, yeah. It really has made a big difference. And of course you do that anyway with the Holocaust Educational Trust. Um, it's uh, just been a delight to be part of this process and it's been a delight to be able to have this new edition uh, published uh, by uh, Little Brown by Spear Books. Um, they, sure they have my they, copy as well. <laughs> They've been wonderful publishers to, to me and to us, and we're all uh, feel and know that this is a very special book, and we hope very much that you'll think so too. So thank you so much for joining us um, today. There'll be a longer version of this chat and interview available online, um, so look out for that. And uh, for now, uh, stay well and stay safe. Thank you. Thank you.